Don't miss out on the special offer from my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They're currently giving you 20% off if you use my coupon code Poodle at checkout and also giving you an additional 10% coins at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I got the coin making method for you guys again. So, to clarify, before anyone comments something dumb down below or they get confused, boys, it's the same one as yesterday, but it's updated. So, what had happened was, if you guys haven't seen Xerxes' video already, so. I, I, I got this method from a sub, I post the video, so then Xerxes watched my video, and he calls me up, and he says, I you missed something, so we started collabing a little bit, talking, talking, and we figured out there was a better way to do this method, and on top of it being, like, imagine it was risk-free before, right, now it's, like, extremely risk-free, like, it's actually, like, that you, you actually win, even if you get the worst thing, like, even more than you did before, and then we were contemplating how to get the coins over, which I didn't really go in-depth on either, because I assumed you guys would figure that part out, so... If you guys watched yesterday's coin making method already, feel free to click off or even watch this if you haven't done all your accounts yet because you can still do these better. Or if you guys want to rewatch it again, because I'm going to be, it's not going to be the exact same thing. I'll probably talk a little different and I'll be going over exactly how to do it like for free. Like this way it actually works for free. You actually, you don't even have to buy the player this time. I didn't even realize this because the player that I didn't mention is a player that I have on my team. So I didn't even think about it. So sorry for that guys, sorry if to remake it, but don't think that I'm remaking this video just because I want more views or whatever, I'm remaking it because I want to educate you guys on how to do it even better. So guys, but if you are new to this video and you haven't even seen the other one and this is your first time watching it, drop a sub for me please, it means a lot and it'll really help my channel out. Also, let's get this video to 100 likes, every time you get these videos to 100 likes, I'll get back on the game and start looking for more methods for you guys and dropping some more heat, so 100 likes. Drop us up and comment down below what you guys got because I heard from other people that this method got them Aaron Donalds, DeAndre Hopkins, Khalil Max, two Donalds. Like, I heard this method worked crazy for a lot of people. And, guys, before you think this is clickbait, I assure you that this method literally is risk free. It is free, it is a free way to get an 87 80 overall, an 87 to 88 overall player for free on five accounts. So, guys, let me get back into this. So, I'm gonna start off by showing you guys. What you have to be concerned with. So you have to be concerned with the Welcome to Ultimate Team, the NFL Epic Solos, which are over here. Let me show you guys where everything is so we have no, no discrepancies this time. NFL Epic Solos and the Assemble Your Team here. So the way this is going to work, guys, you need to go do a set that is going to get you an 87, 88 overall player. If you don't already know it, I'll show it to you in a second. So I, I'm going to briefly cover this. I mean, I, maybe I'll cover it mostly in depth again. In case this is your first time. And if you guys haven't, you can also watch the other video, but this is the new and improved one. So the set is this. It's Baker Mayfield and Damien. The solos is this. Baker Mayfield and Deacon Jones. So these are obviously two 86 overall cards for free. Remember that. Now, on your main account, you can keep these cards and use them if you wish. I put them into the set. So now that's two players. Now let me let me let me wrap this all up for you guys. Let me go show you the set that I'm working with here. So you guys can get a, an understanding of what I'm trying to say because it'll be confusing otherwise. So the set that we're working with, you gotta go all the way over to exchange and come over to 87 to 88. This call this takes two, three 85 to 86 players. So you got the Deacon Jones, you got the Baker Mayfield. That is free on every account you do it on. Now guys, this set right here, to clarify how much you can make, it comes out to about the worst pull you can get is 70K, right? The best pull you can get is 300 something K. So let's say you got the worst thing on every account and by the way every account implies that you can act so the way you're going to do this is you're going to make different accounts you're going to pick different accounts before i get into that the worst you can get 70k the best you can get is about 300 350k so if you pulled the worst thing on five accounts that's how many you can have that's 250k if you pulled the worst thing every time impossible i'll show you guys later why that's impossible it's uh, maybe a few people but don't kill me but literally there's only like three to four bad things you can get and everything else is going to be about everything else is about 90 to 100k so with those numbers you would get anywhere from 400 to 500k minimum and at best if you get like 300k 200k 300k 200k 100k you're looking at a little over a little over a million coins right about a million after reduction so for doing nothing just for playing the game for free and i estimate this will take you about two to three hours per account so if you grind from now to night and you, you take a whole day of your free day i don't understand if you're working your families guys I, I get that i'm not saying go do this but if you have the time and you can do it you could literally grind out 400 to a million coins which is a lot more coins than people see in a month sometimes i'm adding and they don't do pack openings 
So 400 to a million coins is a lot of coins, guys. I highly recommend you jump on this now because obviously the longer you wait, the lower prices will go. The more people are going to do this now that I've done, I've said I got a lot of views on it. Now Xerxes just did it, so he's going to get a ton of views on that. So people are going to start doing this. So I recommend you get on this right now before people start hopping on it and beating you to it. But guys, let's ex let's completely explain this now. So you need three players. You have Baker and Deacon. What I failed to mention yesterday was that there was another free player you can get that I forgot because I have him. So what it was was this Marshall and Lattimore have my team from the welcome to the, um, the game solos, whatever it's called, the assemble your team. You get a free 85, 86 there too. And I forgot because I'm keeping him. So you go to assemble your team. You don't have to play all of them to get them. You have to play three sets. Only the first three is what I did. And the milestones show you here you go. You need to put all these players in your lineup. So as you get them, put them in your lineup, just anywhere. Even just put them in your lineup. You need six total tokens to get them. I'll show you the set in a second. So you need six total tokens. And to get the last token, you need to hit tier 10. So to get to tier 10 is when you're going to get the final token. So you get two there, one there. That's two there. I end up, you end up having six. So pretty much play three sets. You should have two already. Play the welcome to the game solos that you should have just from starting the game. And then do the milestones, obviously. Now, to get to that final set, there's going to be these objectives here that you have to do, which this one was a little more complicated than the NFL epics. So welcome to ultimate team. Hit the wrong thing back out of that okay so welcome to ultimate team is going to be the objective list you want to go to you have to start doing some of these to get tokens so the ones i did were these juju wants to join your team i think you just taught and that rewards you two ultimate trainer things uh let's see that just gain five yards score touchdown click on those you got to do build your core offense boost check out the store three stars check out the nfl epics play on the market ultimate trainers assemble power up I like all these are just kind of you probably did most of them already because it starts just by playing the game but when you complete all those you come over to the set i'm not gonna go too in depth because they're very self-explanatory you just go read them they're in the objectives you do that you do the assembly your team solos and that will be your 185 to 86 you come to this set right here sorry i'm rushing guys i want to get this all in for you i want to drag this and because i did it yesterday already so you guys probably already know so you come to this right here ultimate trainer master set you put all six tokens in so let me recap nfl epic solos Deacon Jones, Baker Mayfield. You need 60 stars for Baker, 120 stars for Deacon. That's 285 to 86s. That should take you no longer than two hours, three hours. Then, this set right here takes you another like 30 minutes probably. It's literally, you have to play the assemble, the, assemble your team solos, play only the first three sets, and then do the objectives. You'll have six tokens. That's three free players. Now, when you're done, you come over to the set right here. And remember, you have spent zero coins. Not one coin have you spent to do any of that zero coin and now you come over here you toss them in i did it already you toss all three in you come out you get an 87 to 88 overall player let me show you guys what you guys could get so you guys have an idea of what i'm trying to say here but remember zero coins have been spent so it's risk free literally there's no you can't even lose coins on this you only can gain now guys remember if you not to make side accounts because people are going to ask me this too you go up to here you go up to here you go to switch profile or add profile you add a profile, you make a fake email, a fake password, whatever, but go into your notes on your phone or a notepad on your on your desk, write down the password in the email so you don't forget it because I know people are going to forget it and then lose their account and then not know to get back in. I also recommend you do no barriers so you can get into the account easily. You do that, you go into EA, you have to make a fake little origin access account, it takes no longer than five minutes. You go in, you level up, you play the solos, you get all three players, you put them in the set, and when you get the card, guys, this is what's important. When you want to transfer it over, listen carefully. People were saying how to transfer it over. There's multiple things you could do. So what me and Xerxes were thinking, first, you can just buy a card that you want for your main account. Let's say you make, you get a Khalil Mack, right? You could trade that over to your main account and you want, you can keep it. Let's, and then if later on in the year, if you don't want it anymore, you trade it back to that account and you can resell it because they're only non-auctionable on the account you trade it to. They're fine on the account you don't trade it to. So that's one option. Second, let's say you pull a Tom Brady, right? You don't want him, you sell him for 100K. You could use the coins you got from the solos and Tom Brady, you can buy you can buy a player that you want and trade them over. That works too. Second, we were also thinking you could buy platinum players. If you guys know how coin selling was working last year, people were buying platinum players. So let's say, let me look up an 84 to 85 for reference. And let me just come down and find a platinum card so I can get an idea for you. So the platinum cards are the guys with the coins on them. I don't know what they are. So let's say Christian McCaffrey sells for 80K. I'm pretty sure, yep, 80K. So what you could do is, let's say you get a Tom Brady, 110K right out of this thing. You can come, 
You can buy McCaffrey, trade him over to your account. You can quick sell him on your current on your main account for coins. You might lose a little coins, but it makes it's the easiest way to probably do it. So you could trade the quick sells over. Or if you don't want to, if you want, you could also just post a card on your main account. You could post like four golds for 50k, 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 whatever. So if you make 115k, post four golds for whatever it is to equal 115k. And you buy them. Or I would recommend using a low elite. Get like an 81 overall elite. Take him. Put him up for 150k. Whatever you got. Buy it. But if you don't want to risk that. Because people have concerns with that. Again the coin quick sales are probably the most legit way to do it. You might lose like 20-30k. But. Definitely the most legit way to do it. Where you won't have any issues. Let's see what Adam Thielen goes for. So Adam Thielen goes for 110k. So you could buy him for 125. Almost send him over. A loss of 15k. But then there'll be no reduction on the other end. So it's perfectly fine. But guys, that should be everything. Don't forget, assemble the team solos, assemble the team objectives. Deacon Jones, Baker Mayfield should take you three hours at max. When you're done with all that, get onto the next account. Could take you 10 to 15 hours to do them all. That could literally be between 450, it's 400 and a million coins. Now to show you guys, you guys can pull. At worst, you're gonna get an 87, which will come out to about, let's see where are the lowest 87s. Larry Allen and Johnny Hecker, which is 85K. So at worst, for free, for just playing solos for a few hours, you get 85K, which is a lot for a lot of people. And then the second option is Zach Martin, 100K. And everything after that's 100K. 100K. But these are 86s. Remember, these are the 87s. So that's 130. Now, let's just say you don't get an 87, right? You get an 88. Because almost all the 87s are above 100K. So at worst, you get an 100K. You get an 88. You can get Brady, Derek Brooks. You can get D-Hop for 170. You can get Bobby Wagner for 180. You can get Aaron Donald. You can get Khalil Mack. Literally, you can get anywhere upwards of a million coins and that lowest 400k after reductions. So guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope this helps you guys a lot more than yesterday's video. I went more in depth this time. I really broke it down a little bit. If you guys enjoyed this video and it gets you guys coins, I hope so. People are confident they got Donald's, Max, you know, all those guys. So I hope, hope that's true. I hope you guys are doing well. If you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you out, make sure to drop a like for me. It means a lot to me. It helps out the channel a lot, and it shows that you guys are enjoying the method, and it, it helped you guys out. So it's, it's good feedback. So drop a like. Let's get to 100 likes in this video. And if you're new, make sure to drop a sub, and hit the noti bell so you get notified every time I drop a video like this. Like when I updated the video. See right now before Xerxes blows up and he gets everyone to go kill the market because that's what's probably gonna happen when everyone watches it and everyone's gonna go do it. So you better get on this now, guys. Do this as quickly as you can. I hope you guys enjoyed, and make sure to comment what you guys get. I'm out. See you guys in the next video.